I have 12 here. I will fuck you. <laughs> no! Oh, God! <laughs> Get right to the heart of the matter with that one. It's like, look, man. <laughs> I will send you really creepy letters. <laughs> I'm gonna soak a sock in perfume and mail it to you if you don't get off the damn shit. I'm gonna call your bank and add myself to every one of your accounts and not spend any money. <laughs> I'm gonna make small purchases at a number of stores so that it spells out I love you on the statement. <laughs> I'm going to take your credit card and I'm going to go to Target and buy a bunch of... Oranges. Like, uh, pregnancy testing equipment. <laughs> so... <laughs> and then distribute them to underprivileged youth. Well, so... So Target uh, uh, files you in their, like, database of marketing uh, uh, data. So they start sending you discounts for pregnancy uh, related equipment. <laughs> pregnancy accoutrement. <laughs> uh, I got all these pregnant lady accessories in the mail. <laughs> I got more breast pumps than I know what to do with, man. <laughs> I can't keep finding new stuff in my house to milk. This stuff should be called, I can't keep finding new stuff in my house to milk. <laughs> <laughs> I've milked it all. <laughs> Been there. Done that. Been there, milked that? Yeah. <laughs> That's it. That's the title. Been oh. there, milked that. Yep, I milked that toucan phone. Yo but, mama. Uh... <laughs> oh. Yeah, they called her Toucan Phone when she was up at the strip club for a while. I don't know what that's about. <laughs> Let's see what this phone call's about. Oh. I'm curious. It's our dad. Oh. <laughs> it's your dad. No shit, dad. It may be none of my business, but don't you think it will be a good idea to take a break? Don't ask who this is. Do the says. words child abandonment mean anything to you? That's right. As far as this game is concerned, we've played it in, like, one continuous streak from bottom to top. So. Have we slept? Oh, uh, yeah, we go to hotels all the time. Oh, But, like, as far as the game is concerned, oh. it's just been running continuously. Uh, hey there, buddy. Don't touch that dinosaur. I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it's inevitable. And he doesn't seem to be going anywhere. Oh. Ha uh, <laughs> ha! What now? Clever girl! Uh. Uh. Small ponds. The dinosaur's one weakness. <laughs> no wonder they went extinct. Yeah, they are really dumb. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Look at that. Bitch! Don't make it. There nice. Okay, so what Lava. kind of prehistoric world do you think this is? I think this is the kind of prehistoric world where... Or, no, we're in sort of a, a, a lost world kind of situation. Yeah, where we're like, oh... We're a journey to the center of the earth kind of situation. Yeah, it's, it's that kind of thing. We, like, fell into a hole. Oh! Hey, guys. What's up? <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, we haven't seen that before. <laughs> How, uh, I like how he's... That guy's totally on fire except the tie. I, I think maybe he's wearing a suit that is made of fire. Also, he's wearing, like, well, a collar on his head. The tie isn't, isn't made of fire. He's wearing just a regular tie. Either way, I'm gonna crack this dude's brains up. So, how do you feel about that? What was he called? Psychic Psycho? Major Psychic Psycho. Psychic Psycho would be a great name for an 80s band, and these dudes already have the costumes. Oh dear. For that matter, it'd be a good name for a 90s band. Yeah. And it is the name for a 90s band. And... This is it. 
<laughs> oh god. Hear their song, it goes. <laughs> <laughs> These guys are doing an ex like an extremely distressingly lo lo yeah, it's bad, is what I'm saying here. Yeah, I'm- I'm not into this. Maybe we should have fought more dinosaurs. Don't fight more dinosaurs. <laughs> For the love of God, do not fight more dinosaurs. Fortunately, Lars appears to be essentially invulnerable to fire, so that's cool. That's a good characteristic to have, you know? Yeah. When you're fighting guys that- that are made of fire. Frankly, at any time, I'd be interested in being totally immune to fire. What if, uh, you're like, uh, who was it who, uh, Demeter took and, uh, covered his body in ambrosia, then burned his flesh off and made him into a, a godlike man? Man, you are barking up exactly the wrong tree. One of those early, early mythological freak, uh, dudes. Oh my god, Rob Z was down to one hit point. Actually, he, you know, he was at zero in the battle, and then he regained one when, when he got back into the overworld. Huh. huh. Or... Wait, that was... Or was did, you revive, did you revive him in battle? I lost track of what was happening. Naomi died and was revived, and then... What is happening in this game? Never mind, Does I don't Rob want to know. Was he, like, wearing a, a revived ring or something? That sounds right for some reason. Let's have a look. Well, it's probably gone now, because he used it up. I think you're right. I think he had an object that allowed him to, like, survive a, a hit or something. Whatever. As long as he's got the snake bag, I don't care. It, it, yeah, it doesn't matter. We're, we're here doing it. Uh, let's keep doing it. Oh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Hey there. It's this asshole. Uh, I haven't seen you in a, in a while. I got a sneaking suspicion that this dude is weak to freeze. But, let me make sure. Bust that ass. Zap! Yeah. Yeah, bust his dome up. What is that on his head, anyway? Is it like a cheese grater? Is that... I assume it's it... some kind of thing to either amplify his psychicness, or to protect him from others' psychicness. Or maybe because he's on fire, uh, he's actually just steaming his brain. And that's like the lid of the steamer that has the holes in it. Oh, yeah. I'm into that. Steamed brain, huh? Mm. Oh! Oh. Oh, God. Is it a skull? Is it a blob? Is it a fire? Huh. Well, it's really all. <laughs> all of the above. Whatever it is, shoot it. Hit it with that bat. You've not seen Nickelodeon Gak like this. <laughs> this is Gak for the ages, buddy. Well, whatever it is, I smacked the shit out of it with a baseball bat and stopped moving, so... It's pretty mundane, soul-consuming flame. Yeah! You damn right I crept up on you. <laughs> Eat it! Yeah, take that. Don't go up to... upstairs. Okay. Those aren't stay. Oh! Many battles are... await you upstairs. Ugh. Oh, God. Whatever you do, don't fight the battles. I... What? Go directly to jail. Do not pass go. Do, do not, not collect. collect $200. A 200 experience. Whatever. Yeah, freeze him. Freeze him. Freeze him up. Also, we started this at approximately... 109. So... What are we doing? What are what, we doing? Why is it that we can't get this started earlier? It's because we're idiots. I, yeah, well, and you were playing other video games. 
Yeah, I play. I spent most of the afternoon playing Battlefield. Oh, it was Battlefield this time. Yeah, we haven't played. Uh, we haven't played Borderlands in a while. Hmm. Those, you're gonna lose those borders. Yeah. This we're gonna, gonna eat. start cre creeping in on you. Oh. Oh crap. He's the dude who knows how to fix this. So now I gotta find somebody who's got a couple life noodles. Uh, there it is. Why is it cool to not write the E in, like, exterminate or extreme or any word that begins with EX? For one why thing. Is it, why is it cool to just start it with the X? Because that's extreme, man. What? Why is that cooler? It isn't. I don't Well, first it. of all, it isn't cooler because it's not 1994. And. <laughs> Uh, it was only briefly cool because it was novel. Was it? What? Is, is... Is removing the first letter from a word novel? I think there's a, a rhetorical term for that. Really? Yeah, uh, it's one of those... So not a word I use frequently, so I'm not gonna be able to recall it, but... If you're really curious, we can look it up later. I am... I'm not that curious. If well, I'm, I'm that pedantic, so I am gonna look it up later. <laughs> later so. Jackass. Let's <sighs> climb this rope. That rope. Yep. Go up that rope. No, go in that cave. No, go up that rope. Uh... Don't go up that rope. I want that present. You can't hop over that tiny little chasm. Yeah, which is is not a video game. Don't be crazy. Hey guys. What? You are you expecting some sort of real world <laughs> logic to be? Ah, <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, it's Casper the asshole ghost. He's got a little mustache. That. <laughs> That's adorable, sweetie. It's like if, it's like if, uh, in the Casper universe, like, Tom Selleck became a ghost. <laughs> I would watch that cartoon. I wonder why in the Casper universe, ghosts, like, get shorter and fatter when they become ghosts. Ugh, it's not fair. Remember when they made uh, Casper into a live-action movie and with a CG Casper? Vaguely. I mean, we were we were like kids, I guess, when that that movie oh, for came out. Oh, shit's like, sake! I remember always thinking it was the dumbest thing because it looked like the cartoon Casper, but it was you know regular live-action other actors. So it you know. Why wouldn't Casper just look like a regular person? Yeah, exactly. Why would he look like a cartoon ghost? Why would he have big eyes and, like, like a huge head? Yeah. Uh. Now you're gonna deal with this goddamn ghost. We you look up what items work on ghosts? I got my, my netbook here, but I don't want to deal with it. Uh, proton pack. Uh, okay. Just, I'll, we'll go down to the vendor and get a ghost trap, a couple of proton packs, zap them up real good. Uh, garlic? Stupid asshole ghost. Healing, maybe? Earthbound. I think this condition is called mini ghost. Mini ghost cure. Uh... Asleep, asthma, blind, burning, cold, confused, diamondized, disrupted, concentration, fleas, frozen, homesick, Mushroomized, nausea, numb, poisoned, possessed. Is it possessed? Maybe. A tiny little ghost follows the victim, 
which on each turn will either do an insignificant amount of damage or solidify someone. Yeah, that's probably it. Is, is that it? Yeah. Uh, I don't know how to deal with that shit. Where's Cure? <laughs> I don't think this wiki gives you the cure. This is not a good wiki. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Oh! Proof you, you bitch! Great. Oh, the ghost itself can take damage. How do you hit it? Uh, oh, somebody uh, somebody else hit it. It got hit by an yeah, AOE attack. And, and that's what it says. It's like, let every party member get damaged and the ghost will get hit. Yeah. That's, a, that's an interesting way of dealing with that. Yeah. Okay. We can add that to the short list of interesting things about our town. Yeah. Freeze him! Freeze him! Ugh! Stop it! Stop breathing fire! So what do you think would happen if something actually did get to absolute zero? Would the electrons break down? Is that what causes electrons to break down? Maybe so. I... Hmm. I feel like we'd violate some kind of rule and the thing would have to cease to exist before it violated the rule. Seriously, what the hell? Everybody in our party is messed up. Well, uh, so the definition of absolute zero is that there's there's absolutely no energy in the system. There's no motion specifically because temperature okay, is, no kin is all kinetic about. energy. Yeah. So, uh, there could still be. Uh, electromagnetic or some other kind of energy. Yeah. Just not energy of motion. What's the object we have that's making us immune to fire? Oh, the sea pendant. Fire, freeze, and flash attacks. Great. So everybody else is dead. So that's awesome. Hmm. Defense shower. Maybe I should have been using that thing the whole time. Huh. Any more life noodles? You see any life noodles? one horn of life on it. <sighs> yep. Let's make this as complicated and as annoying as possible. This dude... Sigh. What if there were a game and that were the object? Navigating the really complicated menus. <laughs> the whole game is just a series of menus. And all you have to do yeah. is make the right choices and eventually... The last one is view ending. That's kind of what, uh, uh, what was that game called? Uh, Space Team? Where it was just like you have the interface of the spaceship and... Yeah. Yeah. That's, I mean, that's basically like a menu. You know, a control panel. Pretty much, yeah. Great, we can't bring Rob Z back. We have a, an exit mouse. Damn it. I hate this goddamn dungeon. Oh, hey, what's up, soul consuming flame? How's it? Uh... Oh, just keep going. You, you might find some. some. yeah. life noodles or whatever. 
I thought the game was gonna freeze up there for a second. It's been, it's been sort of s like stroking out every now and again for a while My now. My internet has been uh, a, a little fishy lately. Huh. Uh, has, has a hard time requesting pages, I think. I'll get that, like, waiting, trying to find the thing you're looking for. Yeah. And then, then once it once it figures it out, it gets it right away. It's not like it's slow. It's like it's like it, it can't do the initial like finding the website. Huh? Maybe it's dropping packets, or maybe you have DNS problems. Try switching to uh, different DNS servers, and I will explain to you how to do that later. Okay. <laughs> a surprise opening attack. We're gonna drop a bomb on him. Side. What's worse, dropping a bomb on it or dropping a train on it? Uh, I'm gonna say dropping a train because you never, you'd never see that coming. You know? But I don't think you would see a bomb coming either. Yeah, but a bomb is still like a sensible thing to drop on somebody. Y yeah, it's sensible because it does more damage. I mean, like. I think if Did someone drop dropped a locomotive on you, you'd be in pretty bad shape. Well, but the area covered by the locomotive would be much smaller than the fall. Yeah, we're not talking about, like, destroying a city. We're just talking about dropping a thing on another thing. The thing is not allowed to be a I, city. I think I, I... If we're talking about just my body, I think I have a greater chance of surviving having a train dropped on me than a fall. I guess. Think about it. If, what, what if they drop the train on you and you just happen to... It, the train lands sideways with the door and, and you go right through the door. I mean, that could happen. Yeah, there's no doors on bombs. That's true. Of course, there are probably more things you can do to protect yourself from a bomb. Yeah, you can put on like, some armor or like dig in a, a shelter or something, but nobody makes a train shelter, man. Yeah. Train will just... Of course, your standard bomb shelter might might do a good bit of work against trains. Yeah. <laughs> this is a train-resistant bomb shelter. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh, we're using all of our PP items on Rufio. Use them all. The fewer items we have in our pockets, the better. I wholeheartedly agree. The ultimate bat. So since you have the ultimate bat, what are you carrying with you? What? I mean, that's the ultimate bat. There are no bats after that one. Yeah. Bat. The fuck are you talking about, man? What bat do you have equipped? That that is the bat I have equipped. That, uh, that's what that E next to it means. Equipped uh, items still take up space in your inventory like a huge asshole. I, I didn't notice the E. I was just <laughs> fucking around top, Stupid, trying to make yeah. conversation about the bullshit in your inventory. That's a mistake, man. Uh, God. There's a shiny coin. Alright, let's do this. There's a face in that volcano. Do you see the face in that volcano? Face? Yeah, see that volcano above you? Yeah. There's a face in it. I don't see the face. Okay, so, uh... It's turned at about three corners. There's oh, the mouth at the that. bottom. And, and the nose... It's just uh, above that and to the left. And the yeah, eyes. Yeah, sort of curves around. Okay. And then... Yeah, it's a face. Okay. It's looking at you. I'm gonna go uh, stab that volcano in the face as soon as I kill these dudes. I, you're just gonna melt your knife if you're trying to stab that volcano in the face. Don't tell me what I can do or not also do. 
What? Yeah. Okay. Good. I'm glad we understand each other. That's right. I suppose I suppose you could make a knife out of well, Spider what would dust. not melt? What would not melt in llama? Ceramic. Oh. Maybe some kind of special ceramic. Like whenever they make uh uh what are they called? Wait, tell me. Uh, what? Crucibles. Uh, I don't know. Cru cru cruci juice. Uh, Ceramic oh. is, is the answer. Okay. Yeah, take it. I remember that was briefly a thing, like super sharp knives that were made out of ceramic. There's a um, a little pen style paper cutter you can buy from Jet Pens that's got a blade that's made of ceramic. Yeah, now we're stumbling for Jet Pens. No, um, it, it's, its reviews were not great. Take that, Jet Pens. Yeah, in your face. I will now spend huge amounts of money on your products. But not that one. That's right. All right, gotta. If you fight that boss, will that little fire get in with you? I don't know. Let's go find out. I have saved our state. Come and get but it. Boss, don't. Yeah, you finally got here. But it's mine now. Take it from me, if you dare. Oh, I dare. Dare I? Dare I? Dare very much. Carbon dog. That's a cool name for a boss. Let's get in. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead so and he's assume. a he's a uh, uh, don't press too hard. That way, we'll make a copy of himself. <laughs> if that's a thing he does, I will poop myself. <laughs> that would be awesome. Punch him very lightly. Use your fountain knife. Oh God. Yeah, defense up for everybody. Take that. Uh. Uh, he said brain food lunch. No, oh, God, that's the wrong guy. Son of a bitch. Oh, here we go. Get that brain food. Drop it on the feet. So let's, let's make a catalog of flaming animals that we know. Charmander. Charmeleon. Okay. Charizard. Uh. Growl life. Uh, Phoenix. Arcanine. Moltres. That weird fire duck from Pokemon. But that's. Is he on fire? I'm talking about animals that are on fire. I'm pretty sure most of the fire Pokemon are on fire. Like Ponyta uh, and Rapidash are. The, uh, the Red Bull from The Last Unicorn. I thought you meant like the, the, the thing from, you know, Red Bull. The food. No, I mean, I mean the other one. Okay. The one that drove all the unicorns into the sea. That sounds rough. That's a pretty cool movie. Did we watch that movie? No, I think we talked about it a while ago. Yeah, pretty cool movie. I'm into it. It's like, but it's in the same style as those old uh, oh. Lord of the Rings animated movies. Oh my god, that thing, what? Became Diamond Dog. Ooh, oh. a Diamond Dog. <laughs> oh crap. Call, call Damon Bowie up. I've got a message for him. What? Uh, that good fits. neutralizer? S defend. What is it called now? It is called Diamond Dog. That's great. I'm into that. <laughs> I'm gonna bust him up again. Get him! Uh, yeah. Stop emitting a glorious light, you ass. Oh god. That glorious light just straight killed Rufio. He's the least important member of our team, admittedly. I guess. 
And what does he do? Uh, he casts our most powerful spell, I think. Yeah! Uh! If you recall, Rufio just kind of showed up. Yeah. He's like, yo guys, now I'm part of this team. He's like, hi, I'm Chinese, and everyone was like... Ah. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Chinese. <laughs> and that looks fucked up. <laughs> excuse me, excuse me, guys, I'm, I'm a Chinaman. I'm a Chinaman. That looks fucked up. <laughs> no, I don't think you understand. <laughs> I'm gonna be neutralizing this dude all night. I know, what beats Diamond? You can't beat Diamond. It's the hardest substance known to man. I'm Is that really true? Is there nothing harder than diamonds? I don't think so. What about su super dense diamonds? Uh, I think there's probably some kind of synthetic thing that might be harder, but I, I don't really know. Get it! Ugh. Oh! Good God Almighty! Oh, oh Lord Jesus! Lord Jesus! I guess carbon might be my favorite element. I'm trying to think. I mean, it's it's in everything. Yeah. Like the most diverse things are are basically just carbon. Yeah. Son of a bitch! Stop that. This thing has a lot know, of hot. Hydrogen is pretty cool. I mean, it's only got the one proton. Sometimes and if you it have... explodes. What does hydrogen explode into? It... I guess it's it's not the hydrogen that's exploding, it's stuff around it that mixes with the hydrogen. Yeah, it, it burns with. Oh, good god. Battle is going horribly. Uh, 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 uh. What are the other other elements necessary for combustion? And uh, oxygen. Oxygen. Yeah. Yeah. Or some kind of oxidizer. Doesn't really matter what. And uh, I know there are more. It's like potassium part of it. Uh, like just just combustion in general. Yeah, like like there's a there's a simple formula for all combustion. It's it's always fuel plus an oxidizer, and that's usually oxygen because there's oxygen in the atmosphere. Yeah, but but the fuel. Well, okay, so it, the fuel can be any number of things. Yeah, like you can just you can just combine carbon and oxygen and burn that, and that's what you're doing in a coal when you're burning coal. I see. Uh, sh secret herb. I didn't pay much much attention in chemistry class. I remember uh, I had chemistry right after lunch, and every day during lunch, uh, my friend Cole Gordon and I would uh, get Wes Reeves' homework and copy it. Nice. Then turn it in. Ugh. Sucks. So, uh, I can't help but notice, you've been fighting this battle for quite a while. And one of our main damage dealers has been out of... Fuck. Oh, our DDs? Ugh, you made all of our people feel strange. <laughs> you gave us the evil eye. Yeah. We keep, like, everybody's confused, so they keep attacking the wrong people. Oh, I don't like this one, man. Yeah, this sucks. And nobody has any PP. Damn it. You, you 
try try pray. Uh, I have been. Pray can bring bring people back, right? No. Well, maybe. Oh. I just got some HP back. This is not going well, though. Oh, fa finally! What? Oh, went back to normal in the sense of not being... not having a status effect anymore. Crap! Use the diamond band on the diamond dog. I don't, I don't think I saw that. This is an equipable. She got a girl. Nothing. Great. Maybe, okay, what, what quest items do you have? Maybe... Crap. Propsy's gonna okay, die. There goes. Yep. Yeah. God, how many... How much HP does this thing have? Yeah! You... Oh! Take that! Alright. That's a lot of I am more excited now than I've ever been at any time in the past. Great. Huh. Took a little while for that last little bit of PP to count down. <laughs> well, that was, uh... Yeah. Too bad Rob Z and Rufio aren't gonna get the thrill. Of seeing the next soundstone, they will be. It just went doing this. Da -da -da -da. Oh, huh. Rufio, Rob Z. That's that's a you're back. A weird feeling to have. Uh. <laughs> How would you know what that felt like, even <laughs> if you felt it? Yeah, like what? No, there is a problem here. I keep imagining myself seeing myself when I was a baby, and that's a thing that literally can't happen, so... Wait, 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 wait. Is that... There's no, like, impression in the ground that looks like something? No, it's, it's this is the fire the spring. Pull up the menu. I mean, pull up the, uh, uh, sound stones. Okay, foot... Go to little footsteps. Okay, footprints. I guess that wasn't really, didn't really look like anything either. I don't even remember what that was. Uh, how did we skip two of these? No, they're just not going in in clockwise order. No, just... we only have six of them. There are eight slots. Look. Yeah, but but we've only done six dungeons. Where the hell are the other two then? They just they said this was the final one. Wait. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Dude, we just did it out of order of it. How? We have What? Did we ever wrap up that whole business in in uh four side where uh Pokey was the CEO of the of the company, and at some point he got in a helicopter, I think, and... Yeah, he got in a helicopter, and he bounced, but... And then we found the crashed helicopter somewhere later, but... That's right. So that, that didn't, I mean, I actually didn't really culminate in anything. Yeah. Uh... I'm trying to think of what, where, what dungeons we've gone through and haven't gotten a soundstone at the end. But there's... Like, maybe we just... Maybe we just missed the last... the last room or something. Huh. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, <laughs> another battle. Yeah. <sighs> what sort are you drinking tonight? Uh, Coke Zero. Nice. Yeah. How about you? I'm having a bourbon and Coke. It's delightful. Bourbon and Coke Zero? Nah, just Coke, Coke. You know how many... Do, do you know 
how much high fructose corn syrup is in that coat. I know exactly how much I don't care. High fructose corn syrup is 55% fructose. What's the rest? Sucrose. Awesome. What? That's bad. According to eminent scientists. What? You suck. I'd like to see some documentation of that. <laughs> For a minute there, I thought you were just beatboxing. <laughs> of course, that was the intro to my new album. I'd like to see some documentation of that by MC Empiricism. <laughs> I feel pretty good about that bit. Uh, I'm liking my new- I got a new cell phone. A word? Word indeed. Tell me about and it. That word- that word is Samsung. Samsung makes good stuff. I got the Samsung, uh, Galaxy Note 2 for free. Impossible. Whole galaxy. Look, man. In, uh, the more you I'm tighten your grip study. on the galaxy, the more systems will slip through your fingers. And boy, do they. I cannot figure half this crap out. It is so complicated, and there are so few words on the screen at any given moment. <laughs> it's like... It's... it's nuts. I mean... You, you, I'm flipping... You, Barely do you, uh, start the phone up, and you click on apps, and there are like three pages of apps. Yeah, it comes with a shitload of them. I got a flashlight, I've got an AT&T code scanner, I've got an AT&T family map, uh, a locker, a navigator, ready to go, uh, smart Wi-Fi. Jesus, that thing came with a lot of bloatware. <laughs> you gotta find out how to get rid of that shit, because fuck that. Well, I, I'm a little worried to do it right now, because the uh, the study that I signed up for might be tracking my activity or something. What's um, the study? I have to submit four drawings every week to the uh, pin-up uh, community, which is just like premium art for cell phones. Do you have to make the uh, the drawings on the cell phone? I think so. I'm, uh, they gave me a program on the uh, for the phone that the sketchbook program for the phone, uh, so I can draw on it. And the the phone itself is like a mini tablet. It has a stylus and. As I recall, it, it's rather large for a phone, isn't it? Yeah, it's it's pretty awkward. But I I really hated my old phone, like. I like... It, it was a, um... You had a, a Motorola Razor, razor right? Yeah. Kicking it yeah, old school. Uh, and the, uh, I've had two Razors, and the first Razor that I got, I loved, had it for five years. Yeah. Um, then I got that other one, and the back, the part that held the battery in, like, never fit on there very well, because the battery had, like, a bulge in it. Ugh, uh, that's not good. So, uh, it, it never fit on, and if you, like, touched it the wrong way, the battery would, would, like, move, and... It would, oh god, then it would just turn off? The, yeah, that thing would turn off. Good lord, off. So that's terrible, you should have returned that shit. I bought it from Amazon, I bought it from No Returns, uh -oh. you know, kind of... <laughs> I bought it from Creepy Rufio it. on the corner, via Amazon. Yeah. But this thing was free, you know, it's a, it's a... I don't know how much it costs, but it, you know, it must be over a hundred dollars. Pretty advanced piece of technology, I suppose. Well, that's pretty but cool. yeah, so I have to, I have to submit four drawings a week to, to pin up, and, uh, I got a card out. Nice. 
Oh, damn it. I've submitted. I got the phone Monday, and I've submitted three drawings so far. Huh. Sounds like you better step the game up, son. Um. I had to sign an NDA. Cool. To do, to do the study. So, I can't really remember what I can't tell you, but I've told you pretty much everything I know just now, so... <laughs> I'm, I'm yeah. reasonably certain you broke that in the <laughs> uh. Wait, just by, by telling you that I, I have to submit four drawings a, a week? I don't know, but... That's all I told you, right? <laughs> yes... What? Who are you, sir? I've never seen you in any anywhere in the world ever before again. What? I couldn't have broken that NDA. You're fucking with me. Surely not. Surely I can tell you that. I don't know, man. Lawyers is crazy. Just like bitches. Well, no one watches our show, so. <laughs> there you go. If Edward Snowden had released his documents on this show, the CIA would not have chased him down. And replaced him with a clone. This soul-consuming flame sucks at consuming souls. I hope you know that. No, it's a soul-consuming flame. What? It is a soul, and the soul... Is itself eating is... fire? Yes. Yeah! So I'm, I'm doing a little bit of extra fighting on the way out because all these things are afraid of us, so it's basically just free experience. You still have your ghost, though. Ah, ghost is a bitch. Get out of here, tiny little ghost. You're drunk. Also, an asshole. <laughs> All right, let's let's get up out of this. Yeah, I'm bored with this cave. Oh God, they're so fast. A little too much lava in this cave. Yeah, the feng shui is all messed up by this excess lava. Well. It's it's amazing how fast uh, you level beyond stuff. What do you mean? You know, when you first walked in here, this crap was hard. Now it's like... These we, are we did, uh, we only had two characters alive at the end of that boss, but also I think they each leveled up, like, twice or something. It was pretty ridiculous. Yeah. Well, I, I, I mean, we had all four alive when we first walked in and fought those two dudes. I mean, and that was, that was not an easy bat. I mean, we were... Yeah. It was a big I mess. mean, we, we, we weren't in, in a lot of danger, but it wasn't, it wasn't easy. Now you're just, like, rolling right over this stuff. In fact, I'm just auto-attacking my way through it. I'm really- You're like a st You're like a steamroller at a wheelchair convention. <laughs> hey, just- Just to be- Oh! Hey, what's up? Oh, hey. Uh, hey, Moon. Uh... Hey, weren't, weren't you a dinosaur a little while ago? <laughs> Moon, I heard you was a dinosaur. He's like, What? <laughs> Dorothy Mantooth was a saint! Man, how the hell are we gonna get out of here? We just have to wait it out. Oh. For 65 million years. Damn it, I was gonna make that joke. Shut up. Yep, yep, yep. Sounds good. Thanks, Dad. Great. Peace. Blah, 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 blah. 
Hey. Well, that's great. You want to call it there? Let's call it there. Uh, Jesus, we've been playing for like an hour, so yeah. We, uh, yeah. we're damn sure better. Alright, let's call it. Okay. Uh, this we're has done. been episode 39, and we will catch hmm. you guys later. Yep. Uh, next week, unless. Oh, oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. That was it. Okay, now.